Hello again. I am sitting at a little known, uh, I guess little, it's a known, not little known, uh, monument. That right there is a little street called the Champs Elysees, which is where all the French shopping happens. And I'm sitting here actually under the Lac de Triomphe, Arc de Triomphe. Uh, that was built, beginning being built in I think 1808 or 1806, uh, commissioned by Napoleon as essentially a pat on the back. Um, I was reading up a little history on it. It's actually the designer, the uh, architect of the of what's it called monument itself, built it as there's nude, um, nude. Nude young people. I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, there's a bunch of naked guys, and they're they're fighting with a whole bunch of guys in chainmail. So it shows that the, the triumph of of differences, and, and uh, when you don't have a lot, you can do a lot, or some some crazy like that. I don't know. It's on Wikipedia. Check it out. But it's a really awesome vantage point. This is where I think six or seven streets come together. Right over there in the distance is the Eiffel Tower. See right there? Aw, look at it, it's so pretty. There's a lady walking right here. Taking a picture of the naked guy. And there's all the names of all the people that Napoleon worked with. And I'm sitting here enjoying my bottle of water under a nice overcast sky. It's not foggy, it's not dusty, it's not anything gross. It's just, uh, Nice calm day. Here it's calm. Over at the end of this little sitway here, right there, is uh, really really windy, and it's it's kind of unbearably windy over there. But sitting here in this roundabout, watching all these cars go by, it's so neat to see all the different types of cars, and then and then all of a sudden I'll see one like at home, like right there behind that bus, uh, right. Oh, right there behind those people, there's a Chrysler 300, and that is a fancy schmancy car because it's imported uh, a great distance. When we're we're accustomed to, uh, you know, BMWs and Mercedes being the the fancy bit here, uh, it's all about the Cadillac, it's all about the Chrysler, it's all about Lincoln, and you know, the cars that we just kind of don't care about anymore. The, the big three, the Detroit three, there was a, our driver from the airport to the apartment. Uh, we, I saw a Cadillac right next to us when we were leaving the airport, and I was like, oh my gosh, why is there a Cadillac here? We were in a, uh, a Citroën, Citroën car, a C6, really nice car in my opinion, like, like exotic, it's a French car, and uh, yeah, he, he was talking about how he would love to have a Cadillac someday, and blah, 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 blah. So, <laughs> and I couldn't help but laugh because uh, he was actually really in love with American society. So that was really interesting to hear too because he was listening to the plain white tees in the car and uh, Lady Gaga. And he just went to Lady Gaga's concert the night before. So, yeah, that's all for now. I gotta go get coffee. So, see you later.